So what if the next big disease, next plague, just decided to do a little bit of trolling? Again, I need to reiterate, it is only a minuscule amount here, and that's gonna be pretty easy to do since I have so many points to mess with here. So it's day one of my bacteria existing, and I'm just going to get literally every symptom. Not gonna get anything else, not gonna mess with transmission or abilities, it's just going to pretty much completely uh, decapitate, essentially, humans. But the thing is, I'm only going to oof like a thousand people and then I'm gonna devolve everything and act like nothing happened. So again, even though we've created literally the world's worst bacteria of all time, we still haven't oofed anybody. The more scary trolling becomes by hurting and oofing people, the harder humans will try to cure it. So apparently because I have developed more than two symptoms, there already will be kind of a cure. People will start to figure it out, but we'll see. Yeah, so they've already technically identified us down here in East Africa and we have already oofed some people. Now, I believe that the disease should have enough ability to like spread from people to people still like we're not gonna die out yet maybe I won't even do a thousand maybe I'll just do 100 okay that seems like a nice number okay now I'm gonna go back in this yeah just just get rid of everything yo we was just joking don't worry about us we don't want to play this game anymore it's all gone I don't even have transmission or abilities either we're just gonna let it play out and see what happens trolling has infected hundreds in East Africa keep uh, increasing the chance it doesn't matter because now everything is different interesting that look symptoms are still ticking up so I don't really know how this works. Like, how do the mechanics work here? Are there now two diseases? Is there now a disease that I can spread that is completely safe? And then does the scary one still continue to spread? It looks like it's still ramping up, but it's not like exponential like it was. Look, no one is no one is dying. That figure is staying just right there solidly. How is this even happening? How are people look? Look at the bars. Look at the graphs that we just did. It's like a whoop and then just went straight back down. Completely disappeared. Humans are still not really interested in a cure. We oofed like 100 people in East Africa and I don't think the humans were even paying attention. We probably need to do way more than that to be honest. Let's just see how far we can go undercover. I am very curious to see how much we're going to infect. Technically speaking, we might just be playing Plague Inc. in the way that you're supposed to be playing Plague Inc. now. Like infecting all the world without any symptoms and then, you know, you ramp it all up and yeah, you, you kill everybody. I don't really want to do that though. Alright, well now noticing that the humans aren't taking us seriously enough, uh, next month I'm gonna go ahead and just do it again all right it is now the first day of September 2023 and uh, we're just gonna get all this again all right so let's just go ahead and start making people insane uh, putting them into a coma doing total organ failure you know all that good stuff and now we're gonna watch as now it doesn't have any immediately interesting look the infection is now rising so fast I don't even know how it was spreading before it was still infecting like dozens of people a day what I might do this time is just let it play out for this whole month and then get rid of it oh we're oofing thousands whoops maybe that's too much we also just got into Central Africa. I guess it depends on like what the humans start to do. If I can get by unnoticed through the month of September, then I'll stop my little bit of trolling. I wonder if this would be different if I started in like France or something. All right, September is up and uh, we're just going to get rid of everything now. Wow, we've actually infected 2 million people and wait, wait, are you serious? We, we Did we kill that many people just... Wait, what? And the the world's still at 0%? What is going on? All right, let's just, again, we're gonna get rid of all this and see if anyone notices. This is gonna confuse the hell out of the doctors. All right, back to normal. We literally have nothing else. Um, again, the charts are looking very strange over here. I don't even know what this means. So literally two million people died. And again, the world doesn't even bat an eye. How did we go by that entire month? I, I don't get it. Trolling has infected more people than TB, but again, nothing is here. We've also made it to Saudi Arabia. I mean, Again, because the humans aren't noticing anything, we don't have to worry about anyone shutting down ports. I'm looking at you, Cuba, Greenland, Madagascar. So now, I mean, it is uh, infecting more people, even though we have no transmission things going on, just because just the number of people. I yeah, I don't even know how is it transmitting. We don't have any way for it to transmit. I don't I don't get it. Do we just like bring it back again for December. Almost 25% of people in East Africa have it. When I ramp up um, all of the symptoms again, more than likely we'll, we'll get to close to 10 to 25 percent of the world all right it's the first day of the new year let's do it man the humans are so dumb i wonder if it's possible to win this game with the humans literally getting zero percent of the cure can that happen i don't know how long i'll let this go i'm assuming that now because we've infected so many people and the death rate is going to just explode there they got to work on something right i'm watching it we're almost halfway through the month we're halfway through the month i still don't have any notification that the humans are working on um oh what is this we've oofed over 75 million people we're 20 days in everything is okay there are 
31 days in the... Okay, East Africa has literally broken down. All right, we're gonna stop. We're at 0%. Oh my gosh, how many times am I gonna have to do this? Okay, I think I think we're fine. We can probably press play, and I'm hoping that we infect so much going on. Wait, what? Oh, no, everything's... Oh, they did go to 1%. Man, I don't like that. You know, I can, de I can probably bring it back down to 0 if I do, like, a little mutation thing. What is this stuff over here? Like, I don't even know. I'm just gonna get all of it. I'm pretty sure I can bring down their cure. Or maybe not. It's sitting at zero or one percent still one of those eventually or maybe it's just like so low that you can't even go down you can't go down from one percent we have oofed 300 million people and the cure is at two percent doesn't even seem fair here's the thing though what is there to research like what are you even doing oh wow infection rate is actually dropping for some reason uh and the death rate is inching forward even though there's no reason for you to die uh, you know remember we have to think that like everything takes a little bit of time that's why like i can adopt a bunch of symptoms people don't die instantly it takes like a week basically so we might have to wait a week for all the death symptoms to go away probably as well maybe okay wait this is a little concerning we're still dropping pretty fast this infection right here oh trolling is now mutated on its own i don't like that don't do that uh sir please don't i will tell you what to do we have four million dna points right now okay i think i actually have to do something about the infection rate because people are still alive i i don't really i don't get that sorry i don't people are still dying i mean they i don't know we've also made it to italy are people gonna start uh uh, like shutting down their borders now. That's my other concern. I'm literally an unstoppable plague god in this game Imagine how I lose that's so possible. Okay. Uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get all this Make sure that we're spreading faster. I wonder if this is even gonna be enough. Have I doomed our disease already? Okay, I have all of transmission and all the abilities unlocked. So can I Devolve this and then just get it again. I don't really know if that's gonna do anything, but I'm still gonna try it Okay, good. Okay infection is now exploding. Whoo that was a little concerning. Oh, 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 wow. Oh, 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 wow chill 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 Whoa, whoa, I can't even get all these bubbles. Relax, relax. Okay, maybe, maybe we're, we might be too much right now. Okay, we, uh, wow, this might be, this is a lot. All right, the entire world is now red. They didn't even have a chance to shut down their borders, I think. Iceland has started to send research teams to infected countries. Well, you can pretty much go anywhere, Iceland, because we have the entire world under our thing. We made it to Greenland. Uh, is that the final country? Oh, yeah, we infected everybody. Oh, okay, well, now this is over. Um, I'm pretty sure the cure is going to stay at 15%. Once once we unlock all these, everyone's gonna die like overnight and it's game over. Well, not overnight. Remember, it takes like a week. Uh, but watch this black bar just explode. And wow, actually look at people. It's gone down. That's right. Oh, that's right. Because when you like start oofing the doctors, that's the thing. Okay, in literally one week, I think we I think we did it like in a week or something like that. Civilization is over and uh, okay, a little simple there. That was weird. That, I don't know what to expect from that. Now, one of the cool things about having a million DNA points is we can essentially create and customize whatever disease we want. And what's really cool about the worms disease is we can easily get symptoms while... Oh, wait, I need the DNA points first. Okay, there they are. We can easily get symptoms and go far into the tree, but still redact others from far behind. So I can just have a game where we're giving people perceptive jolts. What even is that? But as you can see, the name that I've chosen to go with, uh, we are just going to cause people to go blind. Literally nothing else. I can't think of anything more terrifying. We're not even starting out. We're not even going to get the, the basic, like, neuro breach it is just blindness that's all this worm is doing maybe I'll like increase transmission later wait is this even gonna be able to transmit blindness is that that's not really an infective thing we'll worry about that later so essentially everyone we infect here is just going blind that that's it which in a way is even more terrifying than the thing we created last scenario like at least you go into a coma and you just you're just gone we're out here just giving people the john cena syndrome i chose to start off in brazil i don't really know why we are still infecting people again no one's gonna die i don't think well actually you would think that they would if you go blind at the wrong time you know bad things could happen technically somehow blindness is increasing infectivity um it's mainly a severity issue though i don't believe lethality is really being infected uh, affected at all you think it would though how is it not the, i guess the thing is like people aren't going to die exactly from the disease itself but it's going to be from some sort of other thing that you know it's like a chain of things that happen there's gonna be a lot more car crashes or, or whatever i eating worms has infected hundreds of people in brazil this is terrifying i'm just assuming this came out of the amazon rainforest so goal here is pretty much just to blind the entire world i'm gonna be honest that's that's what we're gonna do oh, oh people are dying whoa okay so it is gonna happen i guess i 
don't know. Oh, that's interesting. So some are orange. Is that one red? Is that like due to the casualties? Infectivity is just going further and further up. Argentina has now been infected. I don't think the humans even know about this. This is a terrifying disease. I, I don't know why this is scaring me even more. Yeah, people are having a bad time with this. I'm going to try to play this entire game without changing the symptoms at all. This is the only thing. Now, eventually, I'll start to mess with transmission, which is basically how the worm, I guess, gets around. What's going to be really interesting is when we explore this uh, Trojan Plains, this allows people to, uh, uh, I guess, get ADHD, which encourages hosts to fly to target countries. I guess there's no reason why they can't if they're just blind. I specifically, fly. If they said drive, I'd be like, hmm, I'm fairly certain the entire world would hear about this so fast. There's two million people that just randomly went blind in Brazil. This would be nuts everywhere. This should be like a movie, I feel like. This needs to be like the plot of a movie. Okay, we're now in the UK. We've also made it to other countries in South America. I am actually kind of curious how far we can get without literally anything else. A diagnostics team in Brazil has identified a new disease. Okay, so they finally figured it out that there are eye-eating worms in the world. I don't know. This seems like something they would have known earlier. Maybe the two million people that were infected were like deep into the Amazon. Then that would explain it. Although there's 40, there's 43 million people. now, And now they're just, okay. I wonder how fast they go blind. It probably is like within a week or so. I don't know. It took a while for people to start dying. So maybe it takes like a month. Some weird graphs right here. Like, I don't, I don't even know what to think about this. Oh, so lethality is, you know, pretty significant. It's up there with infectivity. Um, it's just severity. This is this is so severe. Yeah, I'm gonna try just to not do anything else. I'm not gonna touch anything. It's beginning to spread around the world even faster. If I see the cures at like 90%, then I might start to mess with it. They now made it to Europe. It's the it's also first to instruct doctors. You know what? If you think about it, how are the doctors gonna come up with a cure if they're going blind? I, I mean, obviously not yet because we haven't infected the entire world, but if we start, I mean, ah, may, there will probably be technologies that start to pop up where you can use computers and still like do things like you know I don't know I don't know what goes into finding the cures to diseases I just imagine people like pouring liquid into cups you'd probably be able to figure it out even if you couldn't see we'll get automated I, I bet that, you know things like that again our biggest problem here is that uh, people might start to shut down their ports that is where we would we would begin to lose this obviously we would lose this instantly world still still at a zero percent cure and that's with 151 million people infected now we're not killing people that quickly so we definitely will infect enough people for for sure cure is at 1% though. We need to be careful of that. I'm guessing the infectivity is exponentially growing. Once we get to 10%, things should be out of control. I guess, I wonder since they're worms, they can just physically, can they just physically leave the host's body? Are they just out in the ground now? This seems like some sort of alien disease. Like they came to uh, Earth from outer space just to eat our eyes. I'm getting like chills just thinking about that. It's freaking me out. I wonder if they're eating the animals' eyes too. Our eyes are pretty unique things, you know, like you can't just find those out in the universe, so. <laughs> are we made it to New Zealand? That's good. I don't even know why I click on the bu bubbles, to be honest. We don't, we don't need the points. There's, I can hear people like coughing in the game. No, none of that. There'd be no coffee. Six million people have been oofed, and I'm just wondering how. There's probably so many different stories behind this. Brazil has almost completely fallen, although why is it just stuck right there? Hmm, we actually might not be transmitting fast enough. Now I'm getting a little bit concerned. I mean, it's still ticking up, but it's it's not exponential growth like I was hoping. And this is without people, like, really dropping dead super fast, too. We need to make it to China. Okay, so we're now on the Who's watch list. There's also 10% on, they're on 10% of the way to a cure. This looks like we're not going to be able to do it with just one thing unlocked, which would have been insane to be honest. Is that 10 million DNA points? How do we get 10 million DNA? I don't even understand that. South Africa has started to send research teams to infected countries hoping to speed up development for a cure. All right, yeah, they're pretty much at 25%. We're gonna have to start messing with this this a little bit. Yeah, this is too high for comfort. I do want to like encourage people to go to different places. Wow, what is it? Trojan? Pl oh, this is the more we unlock, the more places we can send people to, right? This Trojan roamers causes people to travel more. Again, I'm just going to assume they are not driving. You can technically just get on a boat. I don't know about you, but uh, the last thing I would be thinking about is traveling if I just lost my sight. Interesting that we have someone to control in Africa here. Here We need to, oh, we actually did make it to China. I'm most concerned about, oh yes, Iceland. We need to, we need to look at the uh, scary, okay, so we're in Madagascar, good. Where are the concerning spots? We're in New Zealand. We're here. Are we in the Philippines? We're not in the Philippines yet. I think we have to go to Iceland right now. Also, please give me a, another one immediately. Okay, so we made it to Iceland. 
Normal life in Iceland is beginning to break down. We just got there. How is it? Uh, how, how is that possible? Okay, give me another plane, please. Anytime now. Still a lot of very scary. Pl okay, here we go. I think I'm going to Iceland for sure next. Have to move. Imagine we would make it to the Philippines. We're in China. We're in Indonesia. We're in Japan as well. Okay, give me the third plane. I know it's I know it's got to be here. Oh, there it is. Okay, I think this is the final concerning spot in the whole map. So let's just get there. Cuba basically killed me in my last game. They're the reason why I lost. Okay, everyone's shutting down. All right, this is a little scary. It should be able to just spread by ground here, right? Oh, that cures at 50%. Okay, I might want to try to drop that. Let me just evolve drug resistance. Get all this up. Okay, yeah, that just dropped by 25%. I knew that that's what it did. I don't know why it didn't do it for us in the last game. Weird that all of Europe has been shut down, except like Greenland hasn't, Cuba hasn't. I guess because it's been in Europe for longer. Yeah, we're still not infecting people fast enough. Oh, we have another, uh, we have another airplane. Okay, let's get to the Philippines. That is actually the last concern. I thought we'd get there by now. Oh, we have another, okay, okay, let's just, let's just get over to Russia then. Might as well. I'm gonna go ahead and get these climates too. I guess, I guess we'll just get everything thing in this uh in this tab abilities at this point i can pretty much decide to win whenever i think all i have to do is unlock all of transmission right i don't know 100 percent about that i might be wrong about that oh man the cure is already at 50 percent we need to watch that uh we are in new zealand in australia right are we allowed to physically fly even if they've shut down the oh wow okay so that means that that's telling me that like these people that are infected are like flying the planes i know that autopilot is pretty good in modern aircrafts but i didn't know that it was that good we only have 15 people in canada i'm gonna go here since they've kind of been shut down. Okay, so I, I also want to try my experiment. The cure is at 61%, 62%. Now, last time this didn't work, but it might work this time. I also might need to let it uh, play out for a little bit. Let me just wait. The cure for eye-eating worms is finished and being deployed worldwide. Uh, please don't. Is that, what the what? What happened? Oh, did, because, okay, well, wait. Is that 100%? Can I save this game by just unlocking all this right now? You could not have, okay, okay, it did go down. If you found the cure and then we changed, you didn't, you weren't going to be able to get it to the entire world. I think, right? Is that how it works? If Can I just keep doing that and get it get it down to 0%? Oh, these charts are weird. Maybe I'll just keep doing that. Okay, just, just do that. And then I'm gonna... I don't want any time to go by because then they overnight find the cure. Oh, no. I don't think that's how it works. Uh-oh. Russia is the first to fall into anarchy. Again, how is Russia... They're only at 50,000. The game's confused. The game is definitely confused with what I'm doing. When they get the cure, I'm gonna transmit to everyone and uh, just try to kill everyone before they get it out to like can we destroy the society still that way okay we're getting all of russia come on just spread over just just move over yeah, we're not getting there enough all right we're almost at 100 percent. we have made it to madagascar here let's just get over to poland i guess just just poland by itself all right so the cure has been it's gonna okay look look infection just dropped hugely so what happens now what if i do this just start spreading to everyone is that gonna do anything before i let me just see. I don't even know what this stuff's gonna do. Corpse feeder air three. Can, is it possible that even though they're oh they're they're curing people still faster? Okay. How is manufacturing this good? That's what I want to know. Let me just like individually just I don't know. I don't think it's gonna do anything. I think we might have lost. It's still going down. Okay. Well while, while I have two hundred people infected, two hundred million people infected, I'm just gonna say brick your couch. I don't know why I'm gonna say that. It's an old reference. Okay. You're just just for just because I'm angry. You're all going down. All right. We got everything. Um. I guess this isn't really gonna. Oh wow. Wait. That is gonna make a difference. Reporters are coming all over the world uh, of an extreme obsession with collecting earthworms. Oh, you know what? We might have just changed everything because one of the symptoms is is humans worshipping this stuff. They now love the worms, the brain worms, I guess. People infected with er uh, eye-eating worms are reported visions of the rapture and glorious new overlord species. What did we just do? Oh, they just dropped down. You know, because we adopted all these symptoms, are these new things that humans are going to have to, the doctors are going to have to try to fix? Where are the places that we need to go? Is it possible for us to win this game? My only concern is we're killing people too fast. Oh, we might, we might just oof people way too much um let's get rid of that let's get rid of some of these okay that might be enough to for the lethality to go down there we go there we go let's just get let's just get everyone infected we are in all parts of the world no way is this possible indonesia's gone wait why is new guinea oh we got to go to new guinea where's another plane at i didn't realize new guinea was its own thing uh oh oh new guinea i don't think anyone has lost this game ever because of new guinea i'm so mad at myself we actually could have won that man i wanted to worship our new worm eye eating overlords too and big thing to my patrons. Help, this is the real Drew. I was kidnapped and that's the Drew's imposter. Argentinian the slow, grandpa. depressing portrait Chang and Chang and Chang and Chang and Chang. Right, follow the amateur. $20 Carol Dollars is a lot of John Dan Ryan. Kids know his best girl. Fresh. Robert and by the, pie. the great Ralph. The Polish. I kidnapped Drew. His ransom is five filet of fish. And why am I doing this? 308 Negro Arroyo Lane.